a ghost! Is what I imagine she's thinking with that fucking stupid look on her face. My name is Rage, welcome to some more of the inept crew of soon-to-be-dead morons, also known as The Walking Dead Chapter 2. Let's get this bitch going. Oh god, what inept adventures can we get up to today? How can someone randomly die in an entirely avoidable and easy situation? Let's find out in the next chapter of chapter 2. That makes it a bit confusing actually. So, we're just arriving at the farm, this dairy guy's farm. We're trading, we're trading fuel Here's for uh, Saint John, food Saint and let's up. Hopefully all kinds of shit is going to go down, that's hilarious. How we kept this place so <sighs> For all the bashing I do on this game, it is that's actually really good fun. It's just, you my god. Just, they fry like bugs in a zapper. They fry they like bugs in a zapper. Bolts through that thing with generators and amps. Ah, I see. That's you kind of a good idea. That's a lot. Okay. Who the hell is she? Ever have any accidents? We've got kids in our group. Doesn't seem safe to have them near a lethal fence. Oh, don't no. worry about that. We got plenty to keep them entertained. This place looks untouched. You never know the rest of the world is in ruins. It's worth protecting. Mm -hmm. it's all Definitely. St. John Berry, free Taurus. I thought I saw y'all. God, God this is our mama. I'm Miranda St. John, and welcome to St. John Berry. This Sorry, I'll Lee. just act the hicks. This here's Lee. Couple He's from Macon. From a couple Macon. of our old fam hands were from Macon. They grow I'm good there. <laughs> <laughs> oh I don't even know what to say during Walking Dead. It's just a sp I don't even need to commentate really. It's fucking entertaining enough by itself. All right. I've got it under control. Well, I hope you know what you're doing. That yeah, yeah, yeah. Like it is here. Hold on, I'm still not I that you safe. said someone else was running things. Oh, yeah, I, I thought she was asking about survival tactics. Well, it don't matter. You're here now. We'll make sure you're safe and comfortable. All right. Does that offer apply to the rest of us? We're all incredibly hungry. These are for y'all. Baked fresh this morning. Ooh. Amazing. Can't get stuff like that anymore. It's uh, baked bread. Oh my that's god. Sure. That's right. Hopefully that's like the best thing in a zombie apocalypse. Whatever she's got and be with us for a good long while. Your cow is sick? What's she? We have a vet, but we could bring her here. We can help you folks out. Ooh. A vet? Oh my. Our prayers have been answered. There's clearly something not right here. Well, really, there isn't. This? Y'all go get your veterinary friend, and I'll prepare some dinner. A big feast for all you hungry souls. These guys look very, nice very suspicious. Here again. Danny, why don't, why don't we just shoot them all and take their stuff? That seems why a logical thing to do. And round up everyone for the trip over here. Might want to take someone with you. Remember, those roads can be dangerous. Hmm. I can handle myself. Take this. Oh, don't don't give up our only gun. Anyway. Take care of yourself, Lee. See in a while. All right. Kill the kill the kid on the way, okay? And then everyone will be happy. Mark Lee, why don't you take a look around? Once you get settled in, I could use some help securing the perimeter. To go around the perimeter. Sometimes the dead get tangled up in the fence before they fry and end up knocking over a post. It'd be a big help if you could walk the perimeter. All right. You can learn a little something about our fence. I'm gonna go top off the generators before they run dry. Come get me when you're ready. You betcha. All right. This place is incredible. It's got food. And that fence? Yeah, oh, yes, man, but cl fence. they're clearly if going to fucking cards, backstab they us, they mate. Ha it's place. written all over their faces in plain English. Before we can think about bringing our whole group here to stay, we need to figure out if this place is as safe as they're telling us. Right. Oh, wow, the subtitles and the voice didn't match up there. safe enough for the kids? I noticed a broken swing over there. Not a big deal, but... Maybe there's other things not working that we just can't see yet. Mm. Checking the fence that broken swing definitely is a foreshadow. All right, I'll keep my eyes open, and you find out what you can from Andy. Okay. Maybe I can actually control. I love how like 50% of this game is you watching shit. Okay. Here we go. Hey man, let me instantly talk to you again. I'm pretty sure that'll work. So what have you found out? Is this looking like a good place to stay? I'll keep looking around. All right, keep me posted. I will. I will literally send uh, emails to you. Oh, all right. Look at outlet. 
can definitely tell they built this thing themselves. Okay, good observation, mate. We should really decide to be a uh, detective when we get hey, out of this uh, mess. What are you fixing to do around the barn? Just trying to help out. How secure is your barn? Having a safe place for the cow is pretty important. Thanks to the fence, nothing gets in here anymore. I'll laugh if it's like a zombie cow. Unfortunately, the daddies took most of our cattle before we got it running. Mind if I take a look? Sure, but uh, why don't we do that after we tend to the perimeter? Sounds good. Okay, he's clearly hiding something in the barn. I mean, Jesus. Why are you all so blind? We. What? <laughs> Calm down. Okay. Okay. Okay, main character, what is your stout observation of the picket fence? We. Thank you. I don't even I don't even have words. Look at Bod. Mm, straight. Through a lot of wood keeping those fences repaired. I bet they go through a lot of wood. If they put tools out of the open is as unsafe as it gets. We'll be fine here. Would have been nice to have one of these back at the motor end. It probably would, but that's okay. Look at electric fans. Looks like the fence runs around the entire property, not just the house. Hmm. Yep. Can't take any chances when it comes to safety. Look at his face! He's so got a backstabby face. <laughs> backstabby face! Alright, anything else? Look at house. Wonder how much food they've got in there. Hopefully we can steal it all and murder everyone! I mean, help. Definitely help. Uh, what else is there? The broken swing. Anything else? Nope. Nope. We good. We good. Too bad it's broken. I'll bet Clementine and Duck would have loved something like this to play you on. Still play on it. Kids used to like that old swing even more than the tour sometimes. Yes, because I imagine I'll the tour is brilliant. Mind if I fix it? Sure. That'd be great. Mama, Mama sure does appreciate all you helping out. out. Looks like it just needs a new board for the seat and some rope. Make it safe for Clem and Duck. And let the St. John's know we can pull our weight around here. Alright. Cool. Oh, maybe I can actually fix the, uh... Alright, go! Run! Run! Sprint! Run! Ah. <sighs> nope. Casual walking. You know, no one needs to up the pace when we're in a zombie apocalypse. Don't be silly. Look at generator. What's that? Generator. You guys come along with gas just in time. Alright. Hey, uh, don't mess with that, okay? The thing's a little tricky, and I don't want to spend half a day trying to fix it again. Well, fuck you, mate. Just gonna go grab your, uh... <laughs> gonna go get some planks and a saw. Okay. Mind if I use one of these boards? Already making some repairs, huh? I like a guy who takes some initiative. Yeah, go right ahead. You know I am. I asked you if I could fix this. <sighs> That guy has got some sawing power. Oh, wh where did he put it? Wh where did he... Just casually in his back pocket, was it? <sighs> this guy... Wh wh in fact, where's he keeping the axe? Now that I think about it. Right, let's just talk to that guy. Hi. Hi. Well, I'm glad you guys decided to help us out. I noticed back in the motel that you folks are pretty well armed. You've been stockpiling, huh? <laughs> no one fucks with us. <laughs> We've scraped together a good supply in the last few months. How about yourselves? What kind of protection do you have around here? We collected a few guns to protect ourselves, but we really only use them when we go off the property. When we're inside the perimeter, the fence is all we need to keep us safe. Assuming it works, we are so gonna get a fucking like a herd of walkers coming past here. We can't be the first people you've invited up to the dairy. Well, no, we've made similar deals with other folks, uh, trading for gas and food, but ultimately they moved on, looking for the people they lost contact with. Clearly they didn't do that. They are killing everybody, and they- Oh, what? shit is so gonna go down here, I'm telling you. <laughs> That's good. Uh, the old one wouldn't have, but Mac, he was our foreman, he figured out how to amp it up with the generators. We used to sit out here some nights and watch the sons of bitches sizzle and pop when they got too close. Yep, that sounds like a great activity. These days, I guess. These generators are enough to power the whole dairy? We got lots, and 
gotta keep trading for fuel as much as we can, but they all work together to do the trick. And like us? Let's go Why fix the I perimeter. You with that perimeter now? Oh, good. The fence will stop a walker in about three or four seconds, but it's overloaded if we leave the husks out there. You know, Mark and I can clear the fence ourselves if you want to stay here and finish up with the generators. Well, that'd be great. All I'll right. turn off the northwest section, and uh, if you guys could strip them off and look for any weak points, well, that'd be a big help. Sounds easy enough. Stay Ooh. Attentive. I wonder no. if I, like, I wonder if the quality of the job I'm about to do on the fence will affect how well we do when we get attacked by zombies. Because clearly we're going to get attacked by zombies. So, I mean, when it happens, that'd be quite good if it actually had that kind of uh, retrospective effect. Retro retroactive? So Retro how's the place looking? What? Is it safe enough for us to that word. You know what I'm saying. It's pretty amazing what they've done with this dairy, but let's see what it takes to secure this fence before drawing any conclusions. I can't wait until everyone's out here. Everyone besides Larry. Yeah, we need to kill Larry. Did you have to tell him I thought he was a racist? As if tensions weren't high enough. Sorry, man. It just it popped out. I mean, you did admit it right to his face. <laughs> He's a piece of shit. That guy's a piece of shit anyway. Relax. You're not making things any better riling him up. No, but I will make things better shooting him in shooting him in the face. There's one. Why does it have an arrow in it? Ugh. Lee, it's dead. You can never Come be too on, careful. Push it off. Andy said when this fence is working, the walkers go up like a tree branch on a power line. Okay. If those lights are out, that means the fence is off, right? It better be. <laughs> Maybe the St. John boys are using this guy for target practice? Why is there an arrow? Poor guy. I don't know what got him first, the arrow or the fence. Either way, hope he was already dead. Well, obviously... Pull arrow. Boom! Disgusting. Why was he taking his time? It's made of wood. Even if the server was fucking on... Do you think he the was? server. The set fence was... God. At least it's not one of us. Alright. Uh, get the fuck off the fence, mate. Come on. I'm sure there's still a few more. Alright. Once this fence is patched up, this place will be a fortress. God. Can you imagine not having to worry about the walkers anymore? No, I can't, because the last time the fortress needs people. That happened, we all got We've fucked. Got enough people. So what's your take on the brothers? They seem to have this place tied down pretty well. We can take this place if we have to. We've got enough people to take this place by force if we have to. Sheesh, Lee. You sound like Kenny. Well, that's There's a good idea. One. I see it. That guy's not dead. Totally not dead. Oh, apparently the only option is to push the zombie, so I guess we'll find out. Really? Look Man, at hand. The fence burned right into its hands. I think they fused together. Lol. Alright, X the bitch. <laughs> wow. X the bitch! You never get used to the smell, do you? <laughs> just what, what Nope. <sighs> I I'm I'm just gonna let them do it. What a shoddy job, you Let's know. Stop thinking about dinner. No, we are all Thanks starving, so that's maybe why. It's not easy eating Fool. In front of the kids, but it's all that's keeping me on my feet right now. We'll go ask for more to eat after. I'm hungry, I'm hungry too. too, Mark. Do you think they're gonna be good for it? Dinner for a whole group of people? If they've got as much food as they say, I, I think so. Awesome. Oh shit. Come on. I think I see where they're getting in. This, one's this one must have knocked it over trying to get through. He's tangled up in there pretty good. Come on, help me get this thing back in place. So We're we can totally going to get attacked, aren't we? I think we get better leverage from the other side. Good idea. <clears throat> okay, that was pretty spry. For a whack. No, I thought. <laughs> Alright. Little help here, Lee? Yeah, yeah, shut the fuck up. If you're waiting for that guy to help, it ain't going to happen. Come on. Yeah, yeah, smart ass. Don't die. See, that guy leapt it. My guy's just, like, careful. Telling you that zombie's alive. Oh, and I totally got this. And we await. Holy fuck! What just happened? The fences are on. Why the hell would he turn the fence on? He knows we're out here. What the fuck shit? 
What the? Get to the gate. What the balls? Who the fuck is that? No what? idea. Fuck. Now what? With the fence on that gate, it's our only way out. What the shit is going on? What the? Sh what the? What the balls? We don't need you any harm, goddammit! How many arrows do they have? Did you really think you fuck with us? You assholes! What is their problem? You assholes deserve to die! <laughs> I don't even know what to say. Get closer! Come on out! Really? Fine, let's go right. Uh, the blades are stuck in the dirt. Okay, plow lever. What are they? We didn't. What is? Did they hear me saying we can take it by force, and now they're trying to kill us? Right. Okay. Well, this is pretty cool. This is the most action we've had in the entirety of the game so far. Who are these people? Totally those guys, isn't it? What happened? Oh shit. It's one of the dead we pushed down earlier. Gonna have to move Oh fuck god, this is so ridiculous. This is awesome though, but ridiculous. Alright, stay with us, stay with us. Okay. What is their problem? We didn't do anything. Are you really how many of those things did we push down? You know, this is all very contrived, I'll be honest with you. I really would like to know. I knew one of them was still alive! Fucking knew it! Bash it! Wow. <laughs> that was ridiculous. Oh my god, lol! Well, this is. <laughs> oh, brilliant. Okay. Wow. Didn't fuck with you guys. Let's get out of here. What are they doing? You lucky sons of bitches. Are we lucky? Okay. What the shit just happened? Was it them or was it? Okay, so it wasn't those guys. Lee, what's wrong? Okay. It was a oh goddamn a goddamn ambush out there. Holy shit, are, are you okay? Oh, so it wasn't there on our property. Oh my lord, what happened to you, sweetheart? It was those bastards in the woods, mama? Yeah, I'll be all right once it's out. God damn, it hurts. Oh, probably, it probably does hurt, mate. You've got an arrow through your shoulder. Mark. Oh my god, what happened? He got shot with an arrow. Christ! Oh, nice one! Okay? Nice one there, yeah, uh, Lee. I'm fine. I should Sherlock. Just pull it out. Oh no, honey, come on. Brenda's got you. Come on inside now. We'll have you all sorted out. Well, you must be. Wow. What kind of shit is this? We ran oh hell no, Larry. Up here. Bandits, I guess. I think it was them that attacked us. They gave us a lot of problems in the beginning, killed a bunch of our farmhands. We were able to get them to stop by making a deal. What you do about these people? Food for protection. Not like we had much of a choice, but they did stop hassling us. And now they've God kind of stopped. Damn it. Carly said this place was locked down tight. It isn't a safe, it, it was a fluke. So much for your deal. All right, that one's better, yeah. The broke the agreement. Look, I'm sorry, Lee. If I had any inkling they were going to give you guys trouble, well... We would have gone out there with you. Yeah, yeah. Listen, you've obviously screwed them over like you're planning to screw us over. Stand for this shit. Ain't no Man, I'll stand for their shit. shit. Sons of bitches get away with this. You know where these assholes are? They're hard to pin down, but I think I know where at least one of their camps are. When you're ready to go scope out that bandit camp, come find us. Let's suit up and go kill some hey, bandits. Are you serious? This place isn't safe. We can't stay here. Not safe? This place is a hell of a lot safer than that motor ring. It is actually. I think all of us and our guns can handle a couple of punks with bows and arrows. What we need to do is find a way to get our whole group out here to stay. Take this place over if we have to. Whoa, cool your jets there, Rambo. These are nice people. Let's not do anything to get us thrown out before we eat. Well, Larry, actually made sense for once. With these bandits. 
You guys should try to make friends with Andy and Brenda while I'm gone. Well, that's easy. I got charm coming out of my ass. Yeah. Yeah. That's yeah. real charming, Dad. Yeah. I still want to kill you, Larry. Carly? Since Carly and Ben ate some of the food on the way to get us, she volunteered to stay behind and watch the motor in until we get back. Okay. Hey, uh, I remember seeing kids in your group, so I went ahead and fixed that swing while you were out. Oh, cool. I hope your kids like swings. A swing? I love swings. Just like at my treehouse. Come on, Doc. Why don't you kids All right, cool. Don't want to kill Doc, though. Yeah. In fact, if we just scourge Anytime. his family and Larry, we'll be a pretty good group. Alright guys, that'll do for this episode. Next episode, we'll go to the bandit camp and kill them all, and everything will be awesome! Bly name is Bly. Bly name has been Plage. Do I? No, don't even. Don't even know. My name has been Rage. Please like if you liked, or even favourite, and share it around. Just let me know what you think of this. So, oh, this, this game, guys, it's awful and beautiful at the same time. A oh, goodbye. on fire Minecraft gotta do anything you want him to English failure like and subscribe I can fly